Hey everybody, welcome to DZoned. Let's get to Wad Nathan and uh, Nefcat. Nefcat. That was a tune-up one, right? Yeah, yeah, it totally was. Okay, well we've uh, <laughs> we've already played this one, so um, that's fun. Let's go ahead and Wad Nate again, I guess. Zero four. This map contains the following maps. Map 4. I love these mysterious ones. Let's get right into it. Okay. Uh, 145 enemies. Oh boy. Guess it's somewhat appropriate for a map that replaces the focus. But yeah. Let's go ahead and... Can I even get to this stuff? I don't think I can. Let's not kill the rest of them. I mean, I'll do it when I am a little more secure in my ammo supply, I guess. I know. It's uh, me doing something logical. It's freaking everybody out. Okay. Wait a minute. This looks familiar. <laughs> uh, slightly inspired by, what was it, E2M5, I guess? Very, very similar looking. I mean, obviously there's there's differences, but still. Please tell me there's not barons in here. Like that would just upset me. Oh, there's one baron. At least it's at least it's not plural. Because that would have made me really sad. The night yeah, and the caco. Yeah, this is definitely uh, inspired. Or this room, at least, is inspired by that map. Just with a, a bit of a Doom 2 twist and with less barons, which I always consider that to be a very positive thing. You know, not bad so far. You should just use this. Yeah, it seems a little more appropriate. Hmm. Very nice, very nice. Man, a lot of cover, pretty decent architecture. I mean, this is uh, looking good so far. I know I probably shouldn't say that too soon, but you know, I mean, this is meant to be like live impressions, right? Oh, this map's giving, me, giving off like some very vague TNT vibes to me, I, I don't know. These two keys are a bit close together, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're attainable at anywhere near the same time. So I guess we'll see how that goes. Oh, oh mama. It's an invuln. I, You know, a rocket launcher would be very nice. There's not one in here that I missed, is there? Well, you know, let's do a bit of infighting, shall we? Oh. Neat. Okay. I think those activate the keys, actually. So, yeah, that's maybe a little closer together than I would like. Oop. You guys can invite. There you go. It's always nice when that works out. Ah, oh, they're getting along so well. Look at that. Oh, you hurt my friend. Now you're going to have to die. All right, well, we have somewhat... I could use the plasma against them, but... I don't know. There's a lot of enemies left, and I don't want to end up using the plasma on the wrong dudes. Plus, these guys are somewhat weakened by all that infighting. Somewhat. Oh, nice block map. Take a shot, Aaron. Okay, so um, the soda stream has been used at least once. What do I actually want to use this on? I don't know. Oh, oh nice. Oh, that is beautiful. <laughs> Very ominous. I like it. So, um, yeah, we're just going to leave that alone for now, I guess. Yeah, that, that's actually kind of adorable, not gonna lie. Alright, I think we'll take 
the rest of these guys out. Probably it was just that one guy. Oh, huh. Something, something, in terms of rampagement. Im rampagement. Ooh. Sneaky. You put a bunch of freaking projectile slingers. I mean, I guess they didn't really technically force me to grab the invis. I could have walked around it, but that's good for that guy. Yes, please keep giving me ammo. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Deliver me some shotguns. Please, K, thanks, etc., etc. Alright. Ooh. Good. Good stuff. I like it. Ooh. And the imp even hurt the dude. I like it. Ah, uh, this looks, um, scary. Nice use of dead player things. I like it. Um, you know, overall, this is, uh... This map feels good. You know? I'm having fun. It's not super challenging or anything, but... I mean, damn, is it playable? Also, it has fire blue. 10 out of 10. Oh, it's just a little shortcut. That's cute. Oh, stop doing that. <laughs> Alright, uh... So I got plenty of cells. I could... Oh. Never grabbed that. Oh, jeez. So I was thinking maybe there's another, uh, Kako demon down there. There wasn't. Just his, uh, freakish two-armed brother who spits out lost souls. Thankfully, easily dispatched. One of the lost souls actually hit him from down below, too, so that was kind of nifty. Oop. Stop it! Ugh. So, we got a way out down there. wonder if I can just... Okay, I can't just poke that. That's where the rocket launcher is. Okay. That's where the imps are. Okay. Oh. Ooh. I was kind of thinking that maybe that was a way to get to the, uh... Ooh, that's, that's bad. That is bad. That's a soft lock right there. <sighs> Damn it! Why does this always happen? Like, oh, this map looks good, and then there's just a freaking soft lock. Come on. Why you gotta do this to me? Alright, so you basically have one shot to get the BFG. Oh, thank goodness, I got the chainsaw. And this... doesn't have... that? What? I'm confused. So why on earth does the one side have that stupid crap and the other side doesn't? And another thing, too, is there's that other area that I can get to. That doesn't make any sense. That that should not have been a thing. And honestly, if the intent was to prevent the player from being able to traverse that area more than once, there's better ways to do it. I don't know. It was just very unfortunate. That's, uh... As far as I'm concerned, that's this map's first blemish, and that's a pretty big one, sadly. Oh. Also missing texture. Teehee. Oh my goodness. What is going on? That's a light? Oh! Oh, that was weird. I guess the light amp's actually useful in this section. So I won't switch it off immediately. <laughs> that actually allows you you folks to see this pretty well. So, I mean... On YouTube desktop, the videos basically look the same way that I... that they look to me, but... I think on mobile, they do come up a little bit darker. 
So, yeah, that's a thing. I just, I still don't understand why this had to happen. Why that had to be a thing. So, I don't know. Anyway. Also funny, they gave me both the, oh yeah, right. There we go. They gave me both the red skull key and the red key card. Oh, hell no. Yeah, I need you to come a little closer. Good. How was he able to get that many hits on me when I was invisible? Like, really, Doom? You're being a bastard. And I don't like it when you act like that. You're acting out, and I don't, I don't appreciate that. Really? Jeez, dude. Thank you. Wow. Battle of the Titans. Oh. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Battle of the Titans. Hey, a boner. Yeah, another thing is, um... I really admire the author's restraint by not giving the player a super shotgun. Because, uh, that is a really tempting thing for authors to do. And for a map like this, I would say it really doesn't need it. I don't like this, though. There does not seem to be any clue how to actually... Okay, it's definitely not that side. So like the, uh, well, I, do I just jump? I guess so. Yeah, so with the id software ones, I mean, that's kind of annoying as it is, but one, you can escape the pit. That looks like it's too high to actually jump up if you um, end up falling into the slime. And the, uh, oh. <laughs> nice. And they generally give some sort of hint, like the ceiling being a different texture. Not so in this case. Not a fan. So, um, yeah. Few unfortunate blemishes on this map. I can say it's not going to be a 10 out of 10. It's going to rank pretty highly, though. Most of the problems are... Uh, I guess that's the unfortunate part, is like... In this case, most of the problems I've run into so far are easily fixed, but they're kind of major issues. Okay, secret. I don't know what that did, but um... A lot of invisibility thingies. What does this do? Or where does this go? Oh, same place. Neat. That's an arch file. So, um, shoot the imp, and then we'll... Roar! <laughs> like roar and stuff. I am so angry. Archie's dead. Ding dong, the Archie's dead, the Archie's dead, the Archie's dead. Ding dong, the wicked Archie's dead. Wow. That was some bad nukage rhythm right there. Damn it, I keep, like, firing an extra rocket. This is not good for my ammo supply, damn it. Alright, hit the switch. I don't know what that did. Maybe it opened up that other door right here. It did. And that is the exit. I don't want to go there just yet. There are still four enemies, four secrets, and a handful of items. So, yeah. We ain't done yet, kids. And I am... Well, I'm gonna have to cheat to get out of this, but... That's not a secret? Huh. The only thing I could think of with this is that you just have to wait to get that. But still, that's just... You shouldn't soft lock the player like that. I mean, that's just... I, I think that would go without saying. Could be just one of those things where there just weren't enough testers and the author played through it and just never ran into that issue. Oh. We'll say the author is very generous when it comes to supplies, that's for sure. 
Oh yeah, there's this invuln in here that I never grabbed. So, um, flashbang! Boom! Noise. Now, what do we have next? Oh, see a little white line there. Oh, hello everybody. Found the uh, last enemies. Sweet. What's up? Oh, nice. Well, thankfully, they, uh... Oop, back up. Right about here. Now, these secrets would be borderline impossible to discover, and by borderline, I mean they would be absolutely impossible to discover. But, oh well. They're secrets, and they're not mandatory, so I really can't fault them for that. So there's one more secret and two items to go. I see where the secret is. I wonder if both the items are in there. Right about here? No, just one. Nah, bruh. Alright. Um, oh yeah, the Megasphere at the exit. So, yeah, we know where all the items are. Okay, alright. Let's go ahead and use the BFG since we, you know, haven't used it. Been pining for it and all that stuff. Alright. So, here we go. <laughs> Might as well, right? Alright, that's 100%. Bonk. Perfect. That one's uh, giving us some heretic music, I guess. Nice. Well, that was uh, 04.wad. Overall, very good. Uh, you can tell that, I mean, obviously there were some areas that were kind of inspired by id levels, but, you know, that's Kind of just the thing they did. They weren't ripped off, though. I mean, the de the geometry changed. Like, you could tell there was inspiration, but I don't think it was a direct rip. The uh, soft lock bit is... Mm. Oh, that hurts my soul so much. Oh, if, if, if only... The only two parts of this that really got me were the soft lock and um, that one part... Uh, blah, blah, blah. Um... Near the end, oh my gosh, it was like right, like, right at the tip of my tongue. My god, what happened? What happened? Um, oh yeah, yeah, that area where you're, like, crossing that plasma area, or that plasma area, the uh, nukage area, and you just kind of have to slowly step forward and hope that the platform raises up, and, uh, I, I, I didn't like the way that was made. There should have been a way to escape the pit from, like, to go back to the other side. Which maybe, I mean, it looked like it was higher than 24 units. It looked like it was probably 32, maybe? But, I don't know, it, I don't know if that would have been escapable. I don't think it would have in this, in this case. Um, if I'm wrong, let me know. But, <laughs> yeah. Plus the fact that there was no hint as to where to actually go, where platforms would actually appear. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that area is particularly well designed. The soft lock, though, is the major killer. So, because, I mean, at least with the, the platforms, you could just kind of ease your way over the, the edge and then it would activate. But, yeah, the soft lock was bad. Um, very nasty. That should have just been a step, really. I mean, that, that would have been a simple solution. Just make it like the other side. But all in all, I would say with this one, um, I would give this one a 9 out of 10. And really, most of that is for the soft lock, with a very small sliver of that going to that um, really kind of bizarre nukage pit. Overall, though, a very solid map. Uh, you could tell they learned a lot from just the school of id software when they, when they ended up designing this. So, yeah. Thumbs up. Wouldn't need very much to make this just a proper, very good, like a proper 10 out of 10, really. But uh, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.